I'm wearing Scaffarelli and it is, I guess it's a little 70s with my gloves, I don't know. Yeah, it's giving 70s. <laughs> Riley Keough is making her first red carpet appearance since the death of her mother, Lisa Marie Presley. The 33-year-old wowed at the Los Angeles premiere of her new show, Daisy Jones and the Six, on Thursday, rocking a stunning black Scaparelli haute couture dress. Her husband, Ben Smith Peterson, stood by her side for the bittersweet moment with his arm around her waist. Access Hollywood's Zuri Hall spoke to Riley, who sings in the film at the event, and she opened up about if she would ever consider following in her famous mom, Lisa Marie, and grandfather Elvis Presley's footsteps and release her own music. She also reflected on fellow actor Austin Butler's portrayal of the King of Rock and Roll in the Oscar-nominated biopic. Might we ever, you know, get some, some new music, original work from you? Well, I, I will never say never, but it's not really at the top of my mind at the moment, though okay. I, do, I do like singing, so maybe. You enjoyed it. Good. I did. You know, I, I'm curious to know, um, after going through this process, obviously Austin Butler having such an incredible season on this road to the Oscars, yeah. um, would, is it safe to say this gives you even more of an appreciation for his process, those three years preparing for the biopic? Uh, I mean, my appreciation for Austin's process is, you know, has nothing to do with anything other than how incredibly he portrayed my grandfather and you can, I mean, the first thing I thought when I saw it was, I mean, you can just see how much work he put into it. it it's incredible. So I'm very honored that he dedicated himself like that. Riley stars in the upcoming Amazon Prime video series, which is an adaptation of the popular Taylor Reed Jenkins best-selling novel of the same name. The premiere comes just weeks after the passing of Riley's mom, who died on January 12th after being rushed to the hospital in cardiac arrest. Lisa Marie was buried near her late son and Riley's brother, Benjamin Keough, at Graceland. Prior to her death, the 54-year-old was at the 2023 Golden Globes, where she spoke to Access Hollywood's Kit Hoover and praised Austin Butler. Hi, everybody. Hi. Tell me what we're wearing tonight. Oh, um, God. <laughs> You're like me. Valentino. Something Valentino. Valentino. We just had Austin Butler up here. Did you? Oh, what did this movie mean to you and your family? Everything. It just, it's so incredible. I, I, there's no words um, to describe it. It's just so, it's so important, that movie, on so many levels. And I'm so proud of him and Baz, and I'm just here to support them. And Austin was funny talking about, he worked really hard to get Elvis's laugh down. Yeah. And it was a, like a hiccup of the, did he nail it? Absolutely. Absolutely, everything, even the, the, the voice, the throat, uh, like, what is it, he, he would make these noises sometimes and he got, he got all of it, it was, you know, I don't know how to describe him, but he, all of his mannerisms, he absolutely nailed it. Will you guys stay in touch? Oh yeah, from, sure. from this film, whenever oh, yeah. it goes, whenever he goes, whatever yeah. he does next, do you see big stuff for Austin? I do, I do, such a sweetheart, and just as good. As Jerry was saying, just as good off screen as he is on. Uh, amazing, such a sweetheart, like an authentic, true I was sweetheart. Your dad's friend, so. Were you guys happy with the whole depiction of everything? What a beautiful story. Absolutely. He likes Absolutely. it because there's a lot of him, about him in the movie. Yeah, Luke Bracey plays me oh, in the movie. Nice, yeah. nice. Yeah. Well, enjoy tonight. It's going to be a spectacular night. Nice to meet you.